allowed Sai Rental's employees to immediately leave City Hall. They head to the nearest open space, assisted by local police. This is the first time Baguio City conducts a citywide earthquake drill. For some long-time Baguio residents, the scene brings back distant memories. Baguio City Mayor Mauricio Dumogan still remembers the fateful day of July 16, 1990, when a 7.8 magnitude earthquake devastated the city. Ang unang pinuntahan ko was the Baguio Park Hotel. Talagang, whether you, you like it or not, you will be forced to see tears. No? Maririnig mo yung talagang sigaw ng naintrap kasi nag-accordion yung Baguio Park Hotel. Naririnig mo yung sumisigaw na umiiyak sa loob. The 1990 quake left 1,600 people dead across the country. Baguio was one of the hardest hit with 28 collapsed buildings and infrastructures. During the 1990 Luzon earthquake, around 80 employees and guests were killed when the Hyatt Terraces Hotel, located in this area, collapsed. After 26 years, the rubble has been cleared. But this field remains a stark reminder of the tragedy the city suffered. With the first ever baggy shake drill, the local government hopes its residents will be more prepared should another earthquake strike. All barangays, public schools, government offices, and some private establishments participated in the drill. Residents learn how to properly dock, cover, and hold. According to Civil Defense Cordillera Chief Alex Uy, the city has made great strides in disaster preparedness. But there's a lot to be done. If you look at the system, may sistema, may tao, may gamit. Kaya lang gusto natin iparating, uh, dapat yung investment on DR, disaster risk reduction and management, dapat naka-direct towards addressing the worst case scenario. So marami pang mga gaps na nakikita dito. Uh, basically, yung uh, isang malaki dito, yung uh, evacuation plan. Kasi looking at the map of Baguio City, ilan na lang ang vacant spaces. So kasama dyan yung Melvin Jones Park. So paano natin siya gagamitin as evacuation areas? The Morgan says the drill is an important step to achieving zero casualty. Disaster or calamity is strike without prior notice. Ayan yung dahilan na walang substitute from being prepared. We are going to institutionalize yung pagdidrill natin, pagpapractice natin when calamity will uh, appear. Because as we said, ang hirap yung talagang you will be caught flat-footed when it's going to happen. It's been a painful lesson for Baguio. When the next earthquake strikes, the city of Pines will hopefully be able to prevent, prepare for, respond to, and recover from any emergency. David Lozada, Rappler, Baguio City.